Burning home all dodos under 30 seconds. Okay. I guess no tutorial. I'll just figure out how to play it. Let's go. Is that it? Where's home? Oh. Okay. Have you ever wondered what it'd be like for a Q-Bird and the little bird from Crossy Road to make hot, steamy, passionate love would be like? Well, apparently that's what the developer of this game writes fanfics about, because that's basically what Dodo Peak is. So, if you're not familiar with Q-Bird or Crossy Road, essentially the concept of Dodo Peak is you're controlling a Dodo Bird and you're trying to collect all your eggs and make it back to your like little house without getting hit by any of the obstacles. And so it's like an arcade style game and you hop around crossy road style. And I don't know how else to describe it, but basically you move one block at a time and you have to dodge, you know, snakes, crabs, uh, falling boulders, all kinds of other stuff. And then there's like power-ups you can pick up to make you move faster. There's gold and diamonds you can pick up to buy in-game items. But that's essentially the concept. The levels get increasingly harder the more you play. And uh, there's like a weekly challenge that you can play. But for the most part, that's pretty much the game. That's it. There's nothing, like there's no story to it. Nothing else. It's basically like a mobile arcade game that you would play on your phone. It's a pretty fun and addicting game. A game that you could easily play for hours. And then be like, why did I waste two hours playing some stupid Dodo game? So, I wouldn't recommend it on PC, because it's, you know, not very good compared to very, several other PC games. However, if you had it on your phone, it would be a lot of fun. So, overall, I'd give this game 6 out of 10 bones. Um, it's a pretty decent, you know, fun, simple arcade game. However, I'm going to have to subtract one bone because it didn't have a skeleton dodo. So, 5 out of 10 bones.